One of the many benefits of AZEC trim is how easily it can be heat formed to create custom curves, arches, and ellipses. Using a straight piece of AZEC trim to create a curved profile is much more cost effective than cutting a curved board from a large AZEC sheet. For this demonstration, we will be using a set of electric heat blankets. Please contact your AZEC rep for details about other heat forming methods. To get started, gather your supplies. You will need wooden blocks, two cement boards, the heat blankets, a form or jig to create the curved shape, and clamps. Set up your heating area by placing the wooden blocks on your work surface to protect it from the high heat. Begin your project by preheating the electric blankets. To do this, place one cement board on the wooden blocks. On top of the cement board, place one heat blanket. Then, lay the second cement board down and finally place the second heat blanket on top of the second cement board. Allow the heat blankets to preheat until they reach a temperature of 290 to 300 degrees Fahrenheit. Be careful that you do not allow heated blankets to come into direct contact with each other, as this could cause a short in the units. When the blankets have reached at least 290 degrees, remove the top blanket and cement board. Then, place the AZEC board on the bottom heat blanket. You will then place the second heat blanket on top of the AZEC board. To insulate the heat, place the second cement board on top of the heat blanket. It will take approximately 10 minutes for the AZEC board to heat to the proper temperature for bending. Use a temperature gauge to test board temperature periodically. To check if the board is ready, remove cement board and heat blanket, then gently lift the board. When the heated board has the look and feel of cooked spaghetti, it is ready to heat form. Do not overheat the board, as this can result in a deformed surface or burn marks. When the proper temperature has been reached, remove the AZEC board from between the heat blankets and place it around the jig, starting from one side. You should use only gentle pressure to shape the material around the curved form, as too much pressure may mark the surface. Clamp the AZEC board at each end on the jib and allow curved board to cool before removing. This should take about 10 minutes. After cooling, the board will retain its new shape.